I have had several people ask me, how do I create this look? Well, I'm about to show y'all, and it's so simple. The only things that you guys are going to need is a stretchy type of headband, something that's already sewn together, or if possible, you can do a hair tie and just make sure you tighten it so it holds the hair up in this pineapple look that y'all see and then what you're gonna need is a super long headband or a bandana some bobby pins any type of holding gel that you guys like to use a little toothbrush to get those baby hairs in place and we'll get started so i hope you guys enjoyed this video so here we go okay first things first i am going to take this headband that's really stretchy and I am going to put this over my hair. Y'all see I'm about to choke, right? Mm-hmm. So next, I am going to section off an area that I'm going to create a faux bang. And I'm going to clip it so it can stay out of my way. And as you can see, I'm taking that headband and I'm pulling it back up. And now, since this, the headband is wide, I'm actually going to open the headband up so the width can actually start to capture the hair just on top of my head as you see me doing. Okay, so now it is time to lay these edges because uh, yeah, they need to be laid. Okay, so I am using Procon gel, the brown gel as we all know it, and I am slicking my hair back, creating some little curly tendrils right there with my sideburns. And yes, you want to do this prior to putting your scarf on just so you don't have like all this extra gel on your scarf. And yes, y'all, there is an art to laying baby hair, and we don't just do it like the Michael Jackson and you know, just brush the hair down and create this line no we you know pull a little hair out swish swish and we keeps it moving so you take this long scarf and you want to make sure it's even so that the bow can be even as well you are going to take it pull that scarf up pull it over your ears and I just prefer mine over my ears and you make the back of it as wide as you'd like to cover your headband if you choose to be but because the headband is black along with my hair you ain't gonna see that anyway so I'm tying a bow as y'all can see and I am looping it around and then the next thing that you're going to see me do because this is a three-dimensional bow I am fluffing out the actual bow and I am tucking the ends inside yes cuz I'm going for that pinup type of look and I like my bow to look a little 3d -ish, you feel me so after you tuck those ends in as you can see you just you know straighten it up and then you're gonna take that bang separate the hair grab your bobby pins and what you're gonna do next is you are going to gather the hair together and you are just going to simply roll it up once you get the bang to your desired length take your hair pins and secure it down and voila you have this fab little bang with your old weave because y'all my weave is old okay Fluff it out, just make little adjustments, such as, you know, making sure your baby hairs are still laid, okay? Scarf didn't mess anything up. And y'all, there you have it. Simple, quick style, especially, y'all, I'm missing some tracks in the front. So, I've been really trying not to wear my weave out because I haven't tried to, like, fix it, so bam this is this will do 